hello guys and welcome back to my channel with you today again is mariana in today's video we'll do ombre using gel polish and acrylic powder before moving forward like and subscribe to my channel and let's get it done using the carpet bit at speed 30,000 rpm and moving forward i do the product removal and this client we have natural nails so the job will be here to remove maximum as we can but at the same time do not damage the nail plate so a thin layer of the base coat will be left on nail plate i also want to go with you a quick overview over the product what we're using all products will be from egoista you can find it in our online store all the links are attached down below for nail plate strengthening i will use uv led builder gel so it's a white builder gel and here is the product what you also will need step number one will be acid free primer the second i will need to apply a thin layer of the rubber base this will increase the layer of adhesion because the builder gel is a three-step system then i will do the gel and i will seal everything with super shine top coat this is the product what will be used for nail art, I will use gel polishers, same from Egoista. Number 62, I will apply closer to the cuticle, then to the free edge, I will use a lighter color. Egoista gel polishes are highly pigmented, cream texture, majority of the colors is required to apply just in one layer and in the same time doesn't shrink in the lamp to get nice ombre with a smooth color transition from darker to lighter will be required to apply the colors in a water as i have shown you so from darker to lighter otherwise ombre will be just a mess for tools i will use an ombre brush and also a liner brush this is the single tools what will help me to get a nice ombre. All the product what I have used it, I have attached the link down below and you can purchase on Egoista online store. Back to work using the hand file 100 grid. I will adjust the shaping, filing, sizing and to make sure I have the proper shape before product application. the red flame bit at speed 16 to 1800 i would do the nail plate so i cleaned up the region then using the scissor i trim the cuticle my favorite uh, scissors as usual are from stalex they are sharp trim perfectly they are precise and in the same time they are highly resistant to sterilization process Once the manicure is done, time for product application. I'm starting with acid-free primer. Make sure you apply the primer only on the nail plate. Otherwise, lifting is guaranteed. Secondly, I'm applying rubber base coat. For base coat, remember, we'll increase the layer of adhesion. And pretty much this is a guarantee 
no lifting gel nails. I'm applying just a thin layer and I cure in a lamp for 30 seconds. My lamp is 48 watts. So the curing time on your lamp may vary. For nail plate alignment, I will use Cover White from Egoista. So Cover Gel is a builder gel, which is UV LED, self-leveling, no burning sensation. And having this property of self-leveling is actually helping me to apply the product without top filing or in worst scenario, minimum filing. Believe me, I have tried many gels and with Egoista Builder Gel, I'm finding much easier and faster to do the product application. We I grew up in a place where they told you what to chase, told you how to run the race, every move was on the page. But I didn't like their way Had to fight and misbehave Had to find a way to change Had to leave to find my way Caught up in a daydream I be in my mind up there almost daily It's how I pass time, no opinions safely It's how I understand what I want in this place see. Cause everybody wanna tell you bad things What could go wrong, what fame brings But success is a finicky thing And if you ain't sure, no, it'll never be I don't wanna let myself down Myself alignment is completed and I will not file because the gel was helping me to do the product application perfectly. Now time for design. I'm using gel polish number 20. I'm applying a thin layer. I don't cure. Attention here. Don't cure. And apply first acrylic powder. Clear acrylic powder. And I will cure on the lamp for 30 seconds. After, in a second layer, I'm starting to apply the colors for our ombre and using the ombre brush, I will start blending it and I will cure for 30 seconds. My nail friends and colleagues, please let me know in the comments below if you had a chance to try the acrylic powder technique to do ombre. I'm finding it super easy and this way, even a beginner can achieve a smooth color combination. I'm looking forward to see your results. How do you like the technique using acrylic powder? And also, if you struggle with any specific combination, maybe for ombre, please request it and I may do a new video tutorial for you. For acrylic powder, just to go back, I'm using just in one coat. So on the first layer, after I will not use any acrylic powder. And definitely don't forget about thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. This way I will understand that you like my content and we're moving forward together. Losing time, I'm fading fast I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast Sleepless nights and headaches stack Restlessness to hell and back What's my purpose, what do I grab? A slippery surface, a heart attack And sometimes you just gotta believe There's something that'll give you relief There's something that'll have what you need this ombre was not enough for me, so I decided to add a little bit of sparkle at cuticle. I'm using the gel polish from WOW, also the link you will find down below and you can purchase on our online store. I cure for 30 seconds, then I seal everything with super shine top coat. For baby finger and ring, I decided to do some geometrical elements using the black gel paint and also liner brush, same from Egoista. And in between, I like to add uh, some ombre elements using the same technique, acrylic powder.
Swear I won't forget this, why do I regret this? In my mind reckless, thoughts are feeling endless Sitting up I'm breathless, anxiety's infectious I feel so defenseless, betrayed and embarrassed I hate being open, I hate being broken I feel like an ocean filled up with emotion Anger ain't a potion, rub it on like lotion I can feel it soaking, reopen, the scars have awoken I can't move on till I let go I feel so lost, never at home Need to be strong, every breath hold Cause I can't move on till I let go I can't move on till I let go I feel so lost, never at home Need to be strong, every breath hold Cause I can't move on till I let go I hope you have enjoyed today's video and now you know all my secrets about ombre and also if you have any nail friends who are struggle with ombre technique and want to master it feel free to share this video tutorial with them thank you for watching this video thank you for being here with me thank you for pressing the thumbs up and subscribe see you in the next video which will come next week.